Chapter 101 here, and I, before we get started, I just want to give my shout-outs here to Thunder Ranch Gaming and Drone RC 33. Thunder Ranch Gaming and Drone RC 33. Those are my uh, uh, notification squad winners for today. Um, I haven't been doing videos a lot this past week. Uh, if you notice, my voice is... Uh, I strained it <laughs> doing my last video. And uh, right, I really should be doing this video, but I had a, one of my viewers had a question on how to set up... Uh, the me home app with the me repeater and that's the purpose of this video so let's get to it okay here's how you set up uh, the me home repeater with the me home app first off turn on your quadcopter and next plug in your repeater into your power source next hit add device on the me home app and we're going to add manually now, this is the list of available devices with the Mi Home app. If you do not see a large list like this, that means you didn't select Mainland China when you installed this app. Remember to select Mainland China when installing the Mi Home app so you'll be able to see all this. And you just keep scrolling up until you see Mi Wi-Fi repeaters. There's two of them here. You want the second one that has the reset pin on the front of it. So hit that Mi Wi-Fi repeater. Now it says reset the device after it's plugged in. It's plugged in and to reset it you have to take a pin and stick it into this little hole here for a few seconds here until that light I believe steadies out for a second. It goes out then you can let go and then it goes solid so it's reset. And Then you can hit how to reset on the app. Reset successfully and then it's scanning for Wi-Fi wi signals in the local area and it should be picking that up here shortly from the uh, this particular quadcopter and then you tap to select Wi-Fi there's gonna be a list of what local Wi-Fi in the area and the one we want is FJC here <laughs> it was showing up before <laughs> oh there it is at the very bottom <laughs> RC leading click that one and it says unsecured network we don't care hit OK duplicate network names connect to one of them no just hit uh, the unsecured network now again it can connect unsecured networks I know some people were saying you know it won't connect to ones without passwords that's not true it will now you wait until this light turns uh, blue meaning that the link is from the uh, app to the uh, what or to the repeater to the quadcopter Actually, I think we have to hit next for it to do that. There we go. <laughs> I'm sorry. You hit next, and that app should or that light should turn blue here shortly. Yeah, it's still working, working, working. We're waiting for the connection. And there, we have a blue light. We are done. Uh, and in the future, you know, when you run this app, or you don't need to run the Mi Home app any longer, you can actually connect your phone to the Mi Repeater, and the Mi Repeater will automatically connect to the quadcopter when you're out, out in the field. And when you have that connection set up, you can open up your particular app for, I, this was, I believe, RC Leading app. I don't have it no longer on my phone, so I can't show you it working. But if you got that blue light, you are set up. And we can hit cancel now. We're done. It says connection time dot. Don't worry about connection time dot. That does not matter. Okay, it will remember. It's already it's set up, ready to go, as long as you got that blue light. So don't worry about the connection time dot. So that's how you set it up. So and again, let's I'll show you, let's see if it actually connects to that. Okay, let's see if we can actually connect to the quadcopter via the app. You turn on the quadcopter first and plug this in like so and then with Wi-Fi you go into your Wi-Fi settings and you look for um, I forgot what the name of that is. RC Leading Plus. RC Leading Plus is the name of the uh, repeater right now. That's not the quadcopter. Anything that says plus on it is the repeater. And you just select that and connect to it. And we got a blue light there. And we're connected up here to the plus. 
We do not want to connect to RC leading. We want to connect to the plus. So we're connected. So now we should be able to fly it out in the field. Again, the link is going from the, the phone to the repeater to the quadcopter, and the reverse link is going the opposite direction. So that's how you set it up. Okay, hope that helps.